Hey, what's going on? It's Fist here, bringing you news like I do. I'm not going to put no ads on this video because it's something that I, I care about. Um, I live in the United States. Uh, the Constitution, the Second Amendment, 1971, the right to bear arms, to protect yourself. Because, uh, let's face it, the government and the way things are today, there's not enough funding to go around to protect every single person that happens to every single event in life out there. So, you know, if you have the, if you have the right to bear arms, the Second Amendment, 1971, I mean, I'm sorry, 1791. You know, there's perfect examples of other countries out there who, that it's been ingrained in their society just as long as it has been implemented in our Constitution, like Switzerland, with low crime rates. People who have had guns as part of their life, it's a way of life. People are responsible, the lowest crime rate, out of any country in the world that has the right to bear arms law they have a they they have they have the ability to bear arms you know this this terrible incident that happened in the theater where people take their family you have to realize this i don't expect people that are single, you know, look, you live by yourself, you can handle your own situation. But when you have to tow your wife, your kids, your loved ones with you, you have to always be watching them. And unfortunately, in this country, there's people that don't care about other people's spaces. You know, there's a, you know, this guy literally, you know, the reason he probably did it is because nobody loved him. No one loved him or cared to show enough love towards him. He wants somebody to feel sorry for him. He's not getting enough love. I don't know what it is. But the point is, that's not my problem. That's not the people's in the theater's problem. You know, my problem is to protect my family and to make sure that our family is safe. I cannot depend on the police or anybody else in this world to care about me and my family. I am responsible for my family. That's who's responsible for the safe being of myself and my family. So uh, that is what our forefathers died for. You know, they <laughs> how many generations of family our forefathers have shed blood for that right. You know, if somebody wants to you know, if, you, if you're carrying a gun and two ignoramuses get in a fight and they want to shoot each other over it, then that'll funnel out. Those people will funnel out. You know, it, it's, that's going to happen. There's nothing you can do about that. But at the end of the day, when it's all settled, this will be a more uh, respectful society of other people's space. And that's what we don't have in this country. We have a lot of people that don't respect each other's boundaries. And, you know, that there's no need, you know, I mean, I can't control how parents raise their children and they have a malfunction down the road. But it's my responsibility to protect my family. So if I'm in the theater and somebody decides to start shooting, then I have to give my life for my family and take that guy out. That's what 1791 is about. The right to bear arms, the right to protect yourself. Anyways, your boy Fist. Peace, mouth.